Good morning, Botai. Uh, just first of all, before we say the Gran Lacha, I would be remiss not to mention the, uh, the fact that Am Yisrael is in terrible mourning today upon the passing of Agaon Gadol, Rabbeinu Chacham Shalom HaKohen, the Rosh Hashiva Purat Yosef, Zechet Tzadik Kadosh Lebracha. He was one of the uh, one of the greatest Gdolim the Sfaradim had in this generation, always the right hand of Marad Zechon Lebracha, and uh, always very takif, and always speaking his mind, speaking the Emet, Maran Zechon Lebracha called him Pe Kadosh. So, uh, I don't know if he was buried yet, but Ruch Hashem Tenechom Megana Eden, Be'ezat Hashem, and uh, hopefully HaKadosh Baruch Hu will continue to comfort and lead Am Yisrael as he has until now. Um, last week we spoke about some of the halachot of Kriyat Shema, the zmanim for Kriyat Shema. Now like we spoke about, Kriyat Shema has to be concluded, Kriyat Shema Shal Shacharit must be said by the end of the third hour of the day. We spoke about two different calculations for how to get to those three hours of the day. Now Birkot Kriyat Shema, there's, when you look in the tefillah, the Kriyat Shema is Kriyat Shema itself. Kriyat Shema is sandwiched between the beginning and ending of the brachot of Kriyat Shema, starting off with Yotzei Or, then Yotzei Nameorot, Avat Olam, Baruchat Hashem, Abuchrev Amo Yisrael Be'ava, and then after Kriyat Shema, there's more brachot. Starts with uh, Emet V'yatziv, ending with Baruchat Hashem Ga'al Yisrael. Those brachot, although the mitzvah of Kriyat Shema ends at the third hour of the day, that doesn't mean that the Birkot Kriyat Shema are done. You have another hour, one more Sha'azmanit, to say that bracha. Now, although it's a machloket, according to the Magen Abraham, it's another Sha'azmanit, counting from Alot HaShachar. According to the Gaon Mevilna and the Levush, it comes out from the comes out to the fourth hour of the day, according to, to Nitzach Hama, which is a little bit later, just for La'alacha, since it's something that's only Midr Abbanan. Mikol Kriyat Shema is Midr Abbanan. Therefore, we're Mekil, to go with the later Zman, that of the Gaon Mevilna. And therefore, it comes out, just as an, as an example, Sov Zman Kriyat Shema today, according to the Gaon, comes out at about um, 9.35 or so, yeah? So according to, and, and what, what comes out, the Birchot Kriyat Shema, the end of the fourth hour, is about 10.47. So it comes out even when a person is done, or let's say it happens sometimes that a person is in a place, and their minyan is very late. So sometimes the minyan starts at a time where they're even going to miss the second Zman for Kriyat Shema. So over there, what a person should do is say Kriyat Shema to himself before, Biyotzeh the Mitzvah of Kriyat Shema, then pray with the Tzibur, as long as they're reaching Birkot Kriyat Shema, right? If you're, if you're not make, making Birkot Kriyat Shema by 1047, then you got bigger problems. But anyway, but Mikol Makom, then pray with that Minyan and get Birkot Kriyat Shema by that time, uh, and you will have already been Yotzeh the Mitzvah of Kriyat Shema by yourself. Kriyat Shema doesn't require a Tzibur, you can do it by yourself, although it's certainly better to be Yotzeh the Kriyat Shema along with the Birkot Kriyat Shema at the same time, but if you're late, then the Vadai, that's the way to go as we said. Yom Tov.